Now with the breast, I'm going to make some small slits with my great grandma's knife. Being careful not to cut too far, it's pretty hard not to cut all the way through the skin. It's mainly to let the herbs and spices I'm going to put on it infuse through the flavour of the meat. And for a little bit of presentation too. Going to put some lemongrass. Chili, cafe lime leaf, rub it into the skin of the duck with some salt and freshly cracked pepper. Salt. That just gets rubbed in a little to help flavour through. While you've been watching me prepare the breast, our bones have been browning off in the oven nicely with the vegetables and spices that we put in earlier. I'm now going to add this to the stock pan and cover with water and simmer slowly for three hours. Now I've heated my fry pan up so it's smoking hot. Going to seal off the breast, presentation side down first, for a couple of minutes on each side. Sealing them off properly, we're sealing in all the juices, which will make for a better end product and not dry. Okay, now we're going to finish off in the oven for five to ten minutes, going for a medium rare end product. And now for the grand finale. Retrieve my duck breast from the oven and rest for 10 minutes. So the meat doesn't lose too much moisture when you cut it and it achieves its most tender point. Now, I'm going to show you two versions. My first version, I'm going to have Tom Zenner. with Ceylon style eggplant pickle. Place the breast on top of the pickle and garnish with a green pawpaw and pickled ginger salad with herbs that I've got from my garden. We are then going to garnish with the Duck Zhu. And that is then finished off with some Indonesian sweet soy sauce. And a tiny bit of the eggplant turmeric oil. That gives it a nice little colour effect and also an eggplant flavour. That's our first version for tonight. Esmeralda is looking pretty good, hey? Now, for the second version, some more Pomzana. I just think this goes completely well with duck. I have some asparagus and snow peas that have been lightly steamed. Make a nice platform with them and flatten them out. Don't have them in too big a pile so that the duck can sit on top nicely. I'm going to get my best looking duck breast. We're just going to carve it three times for presentation. Show the beautiful rareness. Fan it out 
I'm there. Oh, look at that. We rested it long enough. And finish it off with the subtropical garden duck jus. Esmeralda times two. So this is it. Muscovy duck done in two different styles. I hope we did you proud, Esmeralda. See you later, guys.